First tonight, a new bill has people up in arms across the state. This new bill would allow guns to be carried on school grounds if there's a concealed weapon permit. Now, currently, state law prohibits people from possessing guns on school property even if they have a concealed carry permit, while federal law says guns can be on school grounds as long as there's a state license. The Wisconsin School Zone Empowerment Act would make state law compatible with federal law. As NBC 15's Christy Batista explains, although the legislation is in the early stages, there are already some critics. That's right, John and Lee. This new bill would allow concealed carry weapons on school grounds, but it allows the school districts to prohibit wep weapons, excuse me, inside school buildings. And Madison School District administrators don't like the idea. Does that mean that people would be allowed to come onto our parking lots, that they'd be able to come to an outdoor uh, recreation activity, for example, uh, a football game, and carry weapons because those would be considered grounds. State Senator Mary Lozick is one of the authors of the bill. She says it would clarify the law about concealed carry within a school zone. It's really all about uh, correcting the glitch in the law, making it compatible, not making felons out of people that have no criminal intent and are, are good people in our society. Gun rights advocates say they have been waiting for legislation like this. If you actually follow the letter of the law, you'd have to stop outside of school grounds, get out of your vehicle, unholster, unload your gun and put it in a case. If we're looking to insulate you know, moms, dads, uh, uncles, grandparents who pick up kids from accidentally committing a felony. Luis Udice is the safety coordinator for the Madison Metropolitan School District. He says currently teachers and administrators know exactly what to do if they see a weapon at school. This would then muddy the water and that it would create situations where staff would have to second guess themselves and ask is this person okay or not okay and then in addition to that, it could potentially create unsafe situations for our police officers who, who work in our schools as well. But Senator Lazic says not every school district feels that way. Some districts absolutely know weapons. Others that want to work with law enforcement and want to explore safety protocols within their buildings. So I think they should be able to do that. Now, Assembly Speaker Robin Voss says it's unlikely the bill will get a floor vote in his House. He says the bill is coming late in the session and he hasn't heard anyone clamoring for such legislation.